our story. It has been 30 years since Vince, the famous archaeologist, returned home from the Zooks universe. Vince is now 70 years old and retired, which means he must have been 40 in the first five Zooks games, and is not in the best of health even for someone who's 70, thus he is ill-prepared for what this for the surprise which awaits him one fateful day. This is Mountains of Zooks. Uh, it's a game that was made by a person named Commodore John and released in 2004. And I really don't know what to make of this game. The basic plot is uh, Vince is trying to uh, get himself into another adventure because he is extremely bored after the events of Zooks 5. Um, he's waiting for adventure, and then his friend Tony comes along, uh, to, I don't know, just for a visit, I guess. And then Vince probably has a heart attack and dies. So it is up to Tony to find a way to revive Vince, which involves getting the Phoenix Potion from the something or other mountain site. Wasn't really paying attention, to be completely honest. Um... Which, these mountains just happen to be in Vince's backyard. Yeah, um, that's pretty much the story. <laughs> Such as it is. Um, and as for the game, like I said, I don't know what to make of this. I don't know if this is someone's honest attempt at making a sequel to the Zeus games, or if this is honestly just a joke game. I am inclined to believe that it is a joke game for the fact that the tile screen says press W to play. Um, I'm sure if I had played longer than five minutes I would have figured this out myself, but this is 365 days of Mega Zeus, and there are a lot of games to play. Um, so yeah, this is the game. Uh, the music is kind of interesting sounding. Uh, there does seem to be a slight problem with the battle engine that I've noticed. I, I don't know if I was just not in the right place, if I was supposed to go somewhere else, but I could barely hit uh, the enemies that I was attacking and they were hitting me for a lot of damage. Um, there is also one point in a battle where I appeared to have critical hit for miss. Yeah, not even kidding. Uh, I, I don't know what that all was about. I don't know if it was a bug or if that was just kind of left there on purpose, but it happened. Um, yeah, all in all, it seems like a thing. Uh, I, I'm really more or less kind of speechless about this game. It's like, uh, here I am fighting turtles, uh, using the strongest spell I have against it, and it's just not going down. And I've pretty much done twice my health in damage on it, and it's still going. I'm obviously in the wrong place. Um, I don't know, maybe if there would have been a better direction, but that one scroll in Vince's house said that there was a secret passage inside the toilet, and so that's where I went. That was my lead. I went there, and I died horribly. Um... Uh, maybe I was just supposed to leave the house and... I don't know. Um, all in all... Is it worth looking at? Maybe. It's a definite, honest to goodness, in your face, maybe. That's all I can really give this game at this point, having only played for five minutes. Um... If you're interested in curiosities, you know, go right ahead and try to figure out about this game what I just could not.